So as you can tell, we're out on the water today. We have our post fly box of July. Let's open this bad boy up and let's get into the goodies. So right off the bat, you can see we got some flies. We'll go over those in a minute. We have this really nice headlamp right here, Black Diamond. Really good name brand quality stuff right there. I already have a headlamp, but it's not this nice actually. I'll let you guys look at those. I'll have to try this guy out later. Might even do some night fishing with this guy. That would be nice. Then you have a, looks like a sunglass little pouch right there. I don't know what pattern of fish that is. Maybe trout? I don't know. I'll have to look that up. <laughs> Let's see what this says right here. Post fly, sunglass pouch, rainbow trout. Yeah, that's really cool. I'll probably even use that for like a GoPro case. Just like a soft little cloth to put that guy in. That'll be nice. Then looks like we have what I would say like a bonus fly right here. It looks like a bait fish of some sort. What's this say? Intruder olive slash brown. Ooh, goodness. Okay, it's not gonna, the camera doesn't wanna zoom. That's cool, okay. But that's a nice little, nice little uh, streamer right there. Let's actually open this guy up real quick. Gotta do this with one hand, one minute. Um, okay. Get that guy opened up. Oh, come on. Ah, come on. Ooh, that's a really nice streamer right there. Honestly, this looks like the perfect fly to throw for like maybe even like a gar, just because it's such a long, long body and it has this one individual hook on the back. Huh, that actually gives me some ideas right there. Nice little fly you got. It's like a bonus fly, I would say, because it doesn't come in the actual pack of flies. Kind of cool. Then you have your leader, as always. And as I always say, on the back, if you're new, if you're experienced, no matter what your experience level, they write what the leader is up here. You go down here and you can learn how to tie a knot. This has actually saved my butt a few times when I'm on the water and I just have a brain fart or something like that. That really helps. I really like that. These leaders are really good. I use them nine out of 10 times. They're really good. I really like them. Good quality stuff. Then you have your cool sticker right here, which, I will probably just stick right there, boop, just like that. <laughs> really cool little sticker, I love those things. And you have your little pamphlet right there. And then as always, you have your little price sheet right there. But let's jump into these flies real quick. It looks like mostly top water, which gets me very excited, especially right now, we're on the river. We're gonna film our next video. Stay tuned for that, that's gonna be after this video. This is just the unboxing. So it looks like we have your uh, two classic flies right here, two t uh, classic topwater uh, fly fishing flies. You have your just your classic little popper and then your little, I always call it like a little bumblebee pattern popper right here. These are really cool. They make a ton of noise, really easy to fish. Let's see if the camera wants to focus. And it does. Really easy to fish. Just a simple fly right there too. I'm pretty sure it's just like a little cork, cork body and some feathers on the back of that guy kind of looks like a frog looks like a bug insect of whatever your choice is but really nice little popper right there and then you have the other one I'm trying to get my rods on the boat you have the other one right here which is just a smaller looking version of that I'd imagine you probably catch some like nice size bluegill on this maybe some like little buck bass really nice little guy again these imitate whatever you can freaking imagine. I mean, cicadas, insects, uh, bugs falling out of the tree. You can probably even uh, fish these for, um, uh, what are they called, uh, paku. You can fish that for like a paku or something like that. If you're currently in the Amazon and you're watching this video, go ahead. <laughs> and then you got this guy right here, which is really cool. I already have a version like this. Don't have this exact one, obviously, but it's a big old, just, big old dirty frog look at that guy that is a cool freaking fly right there that's that nice little cork body so it's gonna have a ton of popping action and it's just again it's just a really simple looking fly that is one thing i love about the flies that come in this box they're always simple they're always simple they're very easy to fish and they're not over complicated that's another reason i like post fly box and then you have i'll just take both of these guys out at the same time you have the same fly just different versions so on the right here, you have a little woolly bugger. It's not weighted. And then on the left, you have a weighted head woolly bugger. Both really good, both really good to have. I would really fish these back to back 
just kind of depending on how the fish are. If they're a little bit more finicky, you might want to throw that one on the right. It's going to be a lighter presentation. And if they're a little bit more aggressive, you might want to throw the guy on the left just because it'll get down there faster, get right in that fish's face, and they'll pop it. These two lures are really good, again, for beginners and everybody. If you fly fish, you need these in your box, let's be honest. And that color, look at the water we're about to fish. I mean, that is going to stand out so beautifully in that water right there, it's not even funny. But yeah, other than that, guys, that is going to be your post fly box. That is going to be your post fly box of July. If you didn't buy it, I hope you buy the next one because you see how much good quality stuff comes out of these boxes. Really good stuff. Oh, and another thing I noticed, and it's not even really like who, who really cares. I mean, I noticed it. Let me close this guy. Look at this nice new box. This is sick. And I, I don't really like you know. It, it is what it is. This box is really nice quality. I know that's not gonna make anybody go out and buy a post fly box, but this is like a really nice quality post fly box. Really cool. I, I really like, I don't know. That's cool, I don't know. And then on the inside, they have all the cool little sayings and whatnot. But yeah, other than that, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And again, I hope you guys go out and buy a post fly box. Super, 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 super worth it. No matter if you're a beginner, an intermediate, an expert, a guide, go get yourself a post fly box. I swear it'll save you money and you'll get on some good fish. Other than that, we are going to go use those flies and go get on some nice fish. Nice. Gonna go get on some nice fish. Other than that, guys, stay tuned for the next video. I promise you it's gonna be a good one. Until then, have a good one. Say yes to fishing. See ya.